Hi everyone. Um, I thought I was going to do a story time and tell my side of the story because the amount of hate that I'm getting, I'm getting I'm getting called all types of things that I've never even heard before. Like it's getting a bit scary and I keep coming and keep coming like, whoa. So I really want to explain myself um, and address a few rumours as well. But obviously before I get that started, I want to publicly apologise to him. Obviously, me and him, we've had private conversations where we spoke, but since it was public, I think the right thing for me to do is to publicly apologise to him. Like, that was bad, but, you know, I made it, it was honestly a mistake. I just, if I knew this would, like, get this far, I wouldn't even, I wouldn't even go to the concert. I don't know, because this is not worth the hate that I'm receiving but yeah since it was public I want to publicly apologize to him so yeah let's just get straight into like the, the story and the rumors actually I want to address the rumors first so why am I okay first of all first of all who's Fafa no who's that person who ever said that my name is Fafa can you come no come please because how I literally, I literally went on stage. I literally said my name is Jess. I said it twice. So I don't know how people are getting this in, like information from. That's not my name, please. Like, no. Um, and also people saying that he's the one that bought the tickets. Who, I beg, who, who told you that as well? Who said he's the one that bought the tickets? It was me. I'm the one that bought the tickets. I wanted me to have a good time because you know, like we're young like real young so like i thought this is a good thing to do let me just take my mind to a concert let's have fun like that's it there's nothing wrong with that i beg since when is it illegal to do so since when that just tells you a lot because us women we can do things as well like if i want to take my man out i'll take my man out so so yeah like i said it was me anyways also me and him like we've had private conversations about going on stage with omele because he does this at his shows if you know if you really know omele you will know that he's done this in his past at his past concerts like this is what he does this is literally what he does like it's nothing new so obviously i said you know him at this conversation like i said to him um if i was to get called on stage i'm going to go on stage and he said that's fine like he's been saying that's fine like we me and him never ever ever had an issue with me going on stage even when the time came like i think there was a video where people were saying like i was moving away from him like i was pushing him away like no like oh my lady she looked at me and said you know he said i'll be to you this <laughs> I just got really excited because Omele is like one of my favorite artists. I don't care what anybody says. Like you all have favorite artists. I didn't want to hear that. Like so, he's mine. So obviously he's my favorite artist, not mine. Um, so obviously I got really excited. I was just genuinely happy. And obviously when I moved to the side, um, that was when he asked me to go on stage. I was just waiting for um. Obviously, the security to get me out of the crowd. That's why I was even stood there 